A lot of people aren't tech savvy or don't have internet, which can make it hard to sign up for vaccine appointments, Rory. And that's where the Gallatin pandemic helpers are stepping up. As News Channel 5's Alexandra Cohen explains, volunteers are making sure high risk people know when it's their turn to get vaccinated. At Ball State Community College in Sumner County, people 65 and up can get the COVID-19 vaccine. Kim Baker at the Gallatin Area Chamber of Commerce is calling pandemic helpers in their volunteer group to reach out to their pandemic pals to let them know. But also find out to make sure they're aware of the current um, vaccine eligibility, the schedule and different criteria as it kind of changes daily. According to the people with pandemic pals, there needs to be more programs like that across the mid state. Something like Vaccine Buddies, which is done in other states. So oh, I think Vaccine Buddy, I love that um, that name. I think that's a great idea. Trent Rogan lends a helping hand to his pandemic pal who is high risk. So I've enjoyed just getting to know them personally uh, beyond just helping them with food or getting them some a ride somewhere. Trent says it's been rewarding. Man, young people, we have to step up too, but also we can learn a lot from the older generation. And so it has been so cool just to hear the wisdom and the advice, but also just the encouragement to keep pushing on even though we've had a pandemic. His pandemic pal figured out how to sign up to get a vaccine appointment, but not everyone is in the same boat. So we've asked our helping pals to kind of navigate this website and understand the information that's available so they can help answer questions of those that they are helping. Helping neighbors navigate how to get vaccinated is a team effort and rewarding. As Trent says, this thank you note from his pandemic pal meant a lot. Reporting in Gallatin, Alexandra Cohen, News Channel 5.